This is a short clip from today's podcast episode. So let me show you something else. So when I don't see a license, right, then I would recommend you do this also. So here in California, again, depends on your state and the laws in your state. Here in California, if you're a contractor, your license number must be on your website, easily displayed prominently so people can see it on any page they're on, which usually means in the footer or up in the header. Most people put it in the footer. Should be on the About Us page, should be on the Contact Us page. All right? Let's give them the benefit of the doubt. I checked the About Us page, the home page. I don't see it. Here we are on the Contact Us page, and I don't see it. All right? So if I'm a local plumber in San Clemente, I can tell you I am filling this out. So your contractor state license board probably has something like this, an advertising complaint for unlicensed contractors. And I would fill this out. I would take a screenshot of those same screenshots. I would print them out and I would mail this up to the contractor state license board and have them look into this particular plumbing company who seems to be practicing under two different names neither of which is prominently displaying his license, even though he is licensed. He's not using that license in his Google listings here, right? So so that's another step you can take for unlicensed people or or just ones who are not or not prominently displaying their, their license number. You don't know if they're licensed or not, right? Now, in this case, we, we do know he's licensed, but not under any of the names he's using, okay?